So how would you grade your performance today? Uh, I was definitely happy with my performance. Um, you know, I'm not too sure of all the numbers and stuff, but I felt good going through through all the drills and stuff. I had some good reports from you know, people I talked to, so uh, I'm really happy with the way I came out and performed today. You obviously, you know, have a lot of film from your time at Bucknell, um, but you, know, you didn't get a lot of, of playing time this season. Do you feel like that makes this opportunity you know, important for you to, to do well? Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, like you said, I, I don't have as much film as some of these other guys being primarily a special teams guy this year. Um, so I, I took this, you know, as you know, like the big final, you know, like you prepare for a test or a final. Um, so that, that was my big thing for this. I knew this was more important to me, you know, than some of the other guys who you know, have more film than I do. Um, so, you know, that's why I treated this seriously. And, uh, and I think my, you know, my effort showed that. What kind of grade do you give yourself when you're fine? Uh, you know, I, I like to, I would give myself probably an A or A minus. You know, I, I did some good things. Obviously there were some things, you know, I want to do a little better in that, that I didn't. But for the most part, I, I was, very, very happy with my performance today. As a local guy, is it, you know, you think about, okay, I'm going to my pro day, is it still a little weird to see, you know, some some scouts wearing Steeler logos and Jerry Olsavsky there, you know, grading your performance? Yeah, it's, it's definitely, you know, kind of surreal. Two years ago, if you would have told me I, I would have been here, I would probably would have laughed, you know, laughed it off. But, you know, having this opportunity is everything. And, you know, if this is the last time I step on a football field, I can you know, put, hold my head up high knowing you know, I got to perform in, you know, in front of scouts and you know, particularly Steelers scouts, the team I've been watching since you know, I was you know, four or five years old. So this, this whole moment, you know, this whole day was more than anything I could have asked for. How much does it help to have your teammates perform along with you? Oh, it's amazing, you know. They, they kind of they gassed me up all year. You know, obviously, you know, during the season, there's you know high and low points. I had some low points, you know, and they, they were there the whole time, you know, gassing me up and having them here today. You know, they're gassing me up again and just being able to train with some of them. You know, they're, they're the best. You know, even being here, you know, for for a year, I feel like I've been here for the last five. Um, a great group of guys. Can't say enough about them and having them here, you, you know, with me today. Sorry, you mentioned. Uh, the Grew up watching the Steelers, Ryan Chazier, James Conner out there. What was that like having them here today? Yeah, that was kind of cool. When, you know, we were getting our me hand measurements. Peek my head, I was like, "Is that Ryan Chazier?" You know, so uh, that was cool to see him. He, he's, you know, an inspiration. You know, to me, just everything he's been through. You know, you know, seeing him kind of being, you know, this close to him was was really cool. Is there more you can do from between now and the draft, or are you just? I'm, I'm going to be ready enough. The team wants to, you know, obviously call me and work me out. I'm mm -hmm. more than willing to, you know, come work out for anyone. Um, I'll continue to train, continue to work out. So uh, uh, that's that's my plan from here. Do you think you're specifically a defensive back? Are you willing to maybe try uh, a receiver I, or something like that? I, I'd love to play anything. You know, yeah. Anything. I don't care where you put me. I, I will gladly play anywhere. Um, you know, growing up, receiver was always my favorite. Um, when I was out of coming out of high school, I was offered, you know, mainly offered as a defensive back. Um, so I kind of adopted that in the defensive mentality. But if the team wants to work me out a receiver, you know, hey, I'd be blessed enough to take it. So, hey, if you want to work me out a linebacker at D line, I'd do that too. Any way to get on the field.